Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiser Reich. As Slanders Baloney, let us continue on from where we last left off. So we're doing very, very well against the International. They're currently at 40%. What are you? You're an infantry division? If you can, like, march your way to Marseille. I don't know if you'll succeed in this, but, like, maybe you will. Potentially, I'd be happy with that. You guys now need a new battle plan. Really, our main focus should just be kill off France. While it would be nice to push away to Iberia, while it would be nice to kill Switzerland or kill the SRI, it really doesn't make sense for us to do so. Primarily, you're worth one. Primarily due to the fact that we don't need to. If we kill France, they will get the, uh, the peace event. And that's really what I'm looking for here. I want all of you actually move your way towards Lyon if you can. 45%. I mean, we'll actually get... This cavalry might actually push its way through this infantry, which would be uh, lovely for us. And you know what? We might actually get Lyon. We might get Lyon sooner than I thought. I don't think that's going to be enough to kill France. We do need to take Marseille. Maybe we need to take Nice as well. But, I mean, we're actually bordering Lyon. There's no units in the city right now. Okay, now there is. Okay, cavalry, once again, it's time for you to push. Put some more support onto this front. And you're all pushing your way towards Lyon. So, so to take the city sooner rather than later. That, okay, that's actually a lot of French forces that they now deployed in the south. I don't know where they all came from. It scares me a little bit. But I'm still overall confident with our ability right now. Gonna have you stop just generically attacking. So Leon was worth 8%. Or no, uh, Bordeaux was worth 8%. It's worth 20 victory points. You're worth 25, so you should be worth a little bit more than uh, than Bordeaux was. How much are you worth? Three? I mean, three is still not bad. 75 with you. Tank division again. Go our way down to Marseille. We did take Lyon. Gets them down to 24%. So we're really in a situation where like every city does matter now. Nancy is worth five. You're worth three. Let's just put one unit down south. See if you can maybe take it. How much are you worth? One? Okay, I want you guys pushing way through here. Because, again, like, as soon as France is dead, all of these German and all of these Austrian divisions can go to front lines. Like, at, there's actually so many German units that are currently... Or, or I guess it's Reichsback forces in, in general that are very occupied with the uh, the war against the Internationale. And how are you guys holding up? And yeah, we got a lot of major cities still under our control. Got 66 against you. This is okay, that's not what we want. I want you. I mean, yeah, like push away to Marseille. That's kind of like your main task. Because you're, I mean, three is not going to win it, right? Three is not worth four, or I guess 5%. I mean, Nancy is worth five. It would get us closer for sure. You're worth one. I mean, if we can just get the Entente to navally invade Marseille, just take the city. That probably would just end the war outright. We're at 39. Our aircraft should all be flying over southern France. How many aircraft do they have? They have a lot. They can probably do some decent damage for sure. What I want to do as well is I want to make sure we can hold cities like Bordeaux. Let's create a little bit of a buffer. Yeah, they do have some units in Marseille. It's not surprising. Dude, negative 130 on you. 50, we can maybe get a bonus. Fifty-four with Red Army. 
I was thinking about force attacking, but I don't really think it actually makes any sense. Okay, we do have Nancy up here. You're worth one. Okay, get your organization back up for a second. I'm going to move a handful of these units in the south that I know are never going to uh, be useful in another battle against France. Bring them up north quickly. So we have a front here we can maybe try to take... We, okay, we took this city. How much, how much is that one worth? 1%? I mean, let's 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 push away into Switzerland, just in case it maybe makes a difference. Uh, technology, let's go for military. Please, probably is not actually what we're looking for. Um, give me excavation too. I'm just gonna do quick save because I realize now I still have player-led peace conference mod on, but that's still that's actually been updated for by blood alone, which of course uh we're not updated with yet. So that might actually break the game. I'm hoping it doesn't, but it's entirely possible. Which is one reason why we're going to be saving here. Okay, Nancy. Okay, get, get some organization, then we'll push away to Nancy. Some units down south. Bangkok's fallen. That's okay. Not bad for us. Lisbon's fallen, but we'll probably see the class of Portugal then. They did occupy a decent amount of actually no, they I think they, they have some more cities here, so Portugal should still be okay. Okay, we're at 60% with Nancy. Once Nancy falls, again, I don't think that's gonna be enough. It's it's also somehow worth 1%. We'll have to reposition you afterwards. Yes, yeah, so we, we need one of these big cities. I guess we'll put you all right here. Yeah, so you eight will now deploy on this province. So we took the city. And we're happy we took the city. Not enough for us to win the war yet, but... Keep you back a little bit. Okay, you're all strategically redeploying. We did take this city. That is worth another 1%. I mean, like, we're just, we're so, we're like a, a hair away from victory. Okay, but our reinforcements are on their way. Okay, I want to take this city. How are you guys doing, by the way? You still have Vienna. That, that's kind of like one of the big things is that Vienna still stands. You're worth three. It's like, I don't think you'd be good enough to win the war. Okay, Ace Pilot's been promoted. How many, how many aces do we have then? We don't have you deployed. Yes, none. Apparently I did. Okay, I'm not too sure. Okay, hold our position. I'm going to do a little bit of pressure against this division. I know it's not going to last too long, but we'll try it. Sixty-eight ninety-five. Fifty-one. How much are you worth? Three victory points. Again, the thing is, like, I know we probably don't even need to get our way over to Marseille. Just a handful of cities on the road there probably will be good enough. On at seventy, bring more units in, push your orders, uh, multiplier. We got the okay. So we got the nineteen forty-one tank. We can take the nineteen forty-one engine upgrade as well. So if you were to upgrade you.
Can I, can I import? No, I can't import you right away. But I need to kind of edit you completely. So we got to go... Two-man turret sounds fine. You need the... Oh, which, which one is it? It's the... Improve... Is it the cannon for the destroyer? Yes. But you're not a medium tank. Okay, fair enough. Small cannon, you're still a tank destroyer. Give me the improved radio. Follow that up with a small cannon. Give me you for reliability as well as more breakthrough the stabilizer get me 10 engines for armor we don't have enough points for this why it's not designed for the tank roll they're not the what is it close support gun high velocity cannon yes okay and i think aside from that we're looking pretty good yes yeah, save this up well are you better 31, break through 30, defense 8.1 versus 2.9. How come you're, how come you have a better armor value? Well, probably because you don't have, you have a different special module. You've got this, which is the, okay, so that's the defense bonus there. I want to make sure you're actually better at 8.1. 8.1, 31, it was a little bit better. Soft attack 10 versus soft attack 15. Hard attack 29. I think because you, you're not the three man threat, right? I mean, that proves your breakthrough. You're actually very fast. What, what, what do you have? Got the small cannon on you. Breakthrough. I mean, so you guys can put it in the small cannon. I mean, it does soft attack goes up a lot. Yeah, I guess we'll save it as this. And that should be better, I believe. Yeah, replace you then with our new advanced light tank destroyer. I know we don't really have the resources for it right now, but don't worry about that too much. Give me even more military factories. Still no... T How many anti airs do we actually have? 300... Okay, 380 should be enough for us to put them in these divisions now. Yes, we do. Fantastic. Save that up. So now our infantry do have some anti-air capabilities. Bring you in. Probably because you're in multiple combats right away. So again, I want you going this way. That's kind of the best option we have here. Bring our infantry in. Follow that up. I mean, Red Army at this point can't really do too much. Yeah, we have German reinforcements that have arrived here as well. Bring you down as so. Multiplier's worth three. You're also worth three. I do. I need to kill you. Like, just just let me take the city, please. Like, I beg you. 59%. Maybe air superiority we don't. Uh, give air superiority. You know, let's fly it over Austria. Let's give them a little bit of air superiority as well. What province are you? Your hills versus plains. Okay, let's actually push away to Montiplier then instead. You don't do very well. How, how bad is our, our uh, city combo with low supply? I mean, it could be doing better. Let's see if making, maybe we can take this province from you. Sixty-two percent. Not quite good enough, is it? And the thing is, like, there's also like not really another easy to access French city. I mean, we have cities down here. I mean, it's worth three victory points. We might as well at least try for it.
because we can increase our combat with here. We have like no organization right now. They're 46 with you. I mean, France, if they can maybe take like one of these other cities, that'd be nice. I need to reposition these guys. Possibly, yes. Maybe, maybe bring the tank around in this province. What? How much is power worth? One. Like they've got just enough units where I can't effectively push in. Let me actually just stretch your line out like this. Maybe that'll make a difference for us. Push you guys down towards the Spanish border. Again, I keep bringing you guys in. Yeah, to bring units in to try to stop us. Push this infantry. We've got better anti-tanks as well. So I guess we might as well, now that we have anti-air actually in our units, we'll place them in as so. Why are you going up? I want you to go to this province. Two units, you're moving your units down. See if we can take you out. Then push your way to this province, and then maybe use that to kind of springboard. I say that, but you've now kind of abandoned this guy a little bit. 340 defense. I mean, you're worth three, right? Genuinely, I do think three would be enough. I mean, they're at 21%. It might round down favorably for us. Fifty-two percent, not that good. I mean, if you take you two, then maybe that'll accomplish one of our goals. Because France, I mean, what other cities do you? You have no cities up in the north. I mean, you have this one, but that's not saying too much. Do you know what, Red Army? I think it's time for you to completely redeploy down here. Just so we can maybe finish those guys off. I mean, the aircraft are looking pretty good. Give me one more anti-air. Follow that up. Just give me, you know, give me a 10% land doctrine reduction guy. I don't know how useful he's going to be right now, but in the future, he definitely will probably be uh, worth his salt. Move you here. We got reinforcements that have now arrived. And take this province. Then we push here, and then we attack multiplier from two different directions. There's really just like not a. It's, where's the supply hub? I guess it's, it's in multiplier. Okay, well, fair enough, I guess. Maybe get a surround on this one French infantry. You also have another. You know, give me Exhibition 3. Why not? I will say, like, did this final. This home stretch is proving more difficult than I thought it would. What if we push our way like this? 52, 44. Okay, 44 is not that impressive. Maybe push away into POW as well. Again, that's going to be worth four victory points. We take both those cities. And that might be enough for us to live a happy life. And then we can redeploy these units somewhere else. Okay, that France is now down to 19%. So uh, yeah, we were we were literally right there. Is the game gonna crash because I don't have the right mod on? No, it's still gonna work. Okay, that's actually lovely. Oh oh no, it okay, it doesn't actually work. Um how many points do I? I have a thousand points. Okay, so it we had to we had to just deal with generic vanilla peace conference. Okay, that's better than the game crashing. Why can I not take these areas of France? Is somebody puppeting France? 
I mean, they shouldn't be. That's not how the game works. Uh, I mean, what would I even want? I mean, I guess I can take, like, Switzerland for my, for my contribution. I do have a thousand points. I mean, it was mostly the French and the Entente that killed Spain. But I guess it doesn't really matter so much. Uh, I can't take this quite yet. Is the Entente? The Entente's in here as well. I mean, sure, we'll take over a small... Ch I mean, can I even take anything at this point? I have 400 points. Sure, give me more of this territory down south. I mean, it, it's kind of fun to see how the AI or how vanilla Peace Conference actually works with, uh... With Kaiser, because it's been so long since I've actually have used it. These are worth a thousand points. Why are they a thousand points? Probably because the Canadians have claims on them. I don't know. And I'm guessing the Entente probably doesn't even have that many points uh, due to the fact... You know what? Just pass me, let's say, three times. Can I select any of these guys to get points to? Okay, I still can. It just it's just a little bit more wonked up. Yeah, give that to the Canadians. Um I mean really for the most part, I would say that the French Republic gets Spain Iberia. So it's weird how it, it worked a little bit, but then in other ways it didn't quite work. What else do we have? Australia still. Uh we'll give that to the Canadians. Apparently it it's been kind of butchered between other parties. Where's um we'll give this to Germany. We're going to have to fix these borders afterwards. Believe me. We'll probably do all of that right now. Uh, before we end off. Yeah, Germany did take all of Australia. Yeah, I'm sure. Why not? I'm sure that seems reasonable. Oh, wait. I gave this to Middle Africa. I did not give this to... Yeah, let's give this to... Riga here. There we go. That makes a little bit more sense. Yeah, because the French Revolution gets all of this land due to the um, due to the agreements that we had. I would have liked, you know, a little bit of territory. And you know what? Shh, don't tell anybody. But I'm going to take a small province for myself. Don't let them know. Don't tell them. Don't tell the French I was here. Oh, but now... Now we have some options, right? Where do we even want to put units? I think we're going to move this army to this front. We're going to set a red army. I mean, they actually have most of our units in the Balkans, which I find a little bit surprising. Red army. Uh, I'm going to put you... Put you right next to Moscow. There we go. But again, really what I'm waiting for is the events to release countries. I'm hoping at some point I will get my option to do so. No, I'm a puppet. Right, I can't. I forgot that the fact that I'm a puppet means that I actually can't give territory away. So I guess I have to do it all manually. Yeah, so transfer all of this to Italy. Congratulations to them. Nice can go to France. As so... give this to you and I guess we'll just give this theory to Germany I kind of wish I didn't have to but yeah I mean I, th I think for at least right now this would be a good time for us to win in this episode I mean we just beat the international which I think is pretty uh honestly pretty impressive I, I thought we were going to lose way earlier but I do think at least right now is gonna be a good time for us to end this episode so thanks for watching have a great time and goodbye